See him having such a good time, filled with presents. His house is filled with presents, not for him, but presents that he has bought carefully and wrapped lovingly with all of his time and love to give to those who he loves. Oh my goodness, I believe there's one for you. Well, now what did you get for your nephew? I don't think you gave him much other than a little bit of humbug. And you know what? Your nephew doesn't care because he's had too much purple drink. He doesn't care about much. And you know what else? There are those around, you mustn't forget, who aren't quite as fortunate as your nephew. Yes, they suffer. And they suffer because of the things that you do and the things that you refuse to do. Oh, that's it. The thing is more... You have so much potential to do good with what you have, and yet you turn your back on it. All right. Whatever said the Scrooge. So, then he went back to sleep. And soon after, he was visited by a dark, sinister. Something he had not heard or seen before or felt in his entire life. It was the ghost of Christmas future. This was not the future that he envisioned of security and solitude. It was clearly a dark and ill-fated place to be. But what happens there?